Hello, my fans of medical malpractice, and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. As you can see, we're starting wave five here, so we'll go ahead and get that going. And we've got our people coming into work as well at the same time here, so that'll work out well. I have no idea what these hammerhead guys are. Uh, do I have a room that would seem to deal with that? Not that I can tell. So for now, I'm just going to leave it alone and let people do as they might. And we'll see from there. So we have to upgrade two machines. That's not a problem. I'd like to do that anyways. And we have to generate 250 research points. That actually is a problem that I had not planned on. I'm going to have to build a research center for that. And... But you know what? That'll work out in our favor. I needed to make some extra cash anyways. So we'll go ahead and put in a research center here. Just a moment. I'm going to step away from this map and go ahead and get one of my previous research centers that'll work fine for this. Alright, and we are back. I went ahead and picked up a template from one of my other hospitals for a research center. That way I just have it put in here. Uh, let's see, it's a cold temp one, and it's going to cost a bunch of money to put in. So, you know, I might not actually end up using that. While it would be convenient, I think I might just go ahead and build one from scratch. Once we have some money here, of course. We'll accept that, that's easy enough. We'll get this money going on. We got Rambo there walking around, not sure exactly what his deal is. But I guess we'll see soon enough. Doesn't look like we're gonna be able to get that staff challenge done, we just didn't have enough ghosts. Alright. You want to upgrade these machines, but the first thing I'm going to put in is going to be the research room. And I'll just put it in myself. One second, fine. Research is going to cost 35,000. Uh, Health inspection, sure, we'll take that. We have paid off our loans, so we're not having to worry about that as far as money right now. But you know what? I think I'm going to take the big loan out. That way I can put in this research room and have it cranking along. Is really what I need the research room for. Uh, let me see, what was the... Let's actually go ahead and cancel that. See what the template was as far as size wise. Alright. We have to get rid of some things I know. We'll get rid of all the 
monitors around the room. Alright, we could leave... No, we can't leave that one. Alright, so we gotta go very basic here. I am going to need to put in some air conditioning units here as well because this room was originally set up for a hot location or a, to be a hot location uh, in a cool climate and that's not going to work here. So let's see if those two units will do enough. I mean the cryptology is sort of cool. But I wouldn't mind getting something where we're actually making some extra money for the hospital. So let's start that project. Let's hire another doctor that can go in here. Because I'm pretty sure one of my staff already has research as a possibility, doesn't he? No, they don't. Alright, well I'm going to have to hire somebody that I can then train for research, which is unfortunate. All right, let's take out the other loan, sadly. Let's get somebody hired. Go as cheap as we can. We're gonna train them in research. Bring in somebody to start their training. All right, and they will be training in Roderick's plot hole which will make us some decent money, which will be a good thing. And then that particular staff member, we want her only going to be working in research, nothing else. So we'll get her on the go there as quickly as we can. If I could pay off that one loan before the end of the month, I'd love to do so. I don't think I'm going to be able to, though. Hey, I was able to. Perfect. Patients should seem less sick and more cured during the health inspector's visit. Alright, we upgraded one machine already, so that worked out nicely. Maintenance announcement. I'm just concerned I'm going to need another room for these people. So, that is a thing I'm very well aware of. need to decorate the hospital a bit more as well, but that's just something we're going to have to deal with here in a little while. Okay, well, he's going to have to wait as far as his staff training. We are getting one of these hammerhead people in, which is a good thing because I don't know what they even have. Yes, we're getting the doctor trained in research. Don't worry about that. matter of I just need some money coming in and I need to know where some of these people go. <laughs> Seems to be a recurring theme with this particular challenge is just needing facilities that I don't really have and so I'm going to spend money I don't have taking out loans so on and so forth. Just about when I recover that's when I need to do something new all over again. But we're going to take that loan out because I want to go ahead and get that upgrading. We 
know it's going to be needed here soon enough. After four rudderless years, Two Point County has never been in greater need of strong leadership. So vote for four more years of Tabitha Winsock in the mayoral elections. Tabitha Winsock, wrong but stable. Serving Two Point County. This is Two Point Radio. I'm just curious what these two new types of people are going to need here. Headache. An extreme form of headache that hardens the sufferer's head, giving it a subtle, often impenetrable metallic quality. So they'll go to our injection. Alright. They need to keep their head still for a while and be given an injection of laid-back vibes caused by power cords, rocks, and or rolls, and not drinking enough water. Alright, so we don't need another room for them. That's great news. I would like to upgrade our injection room. That would be a nicety. Still wondering what the other type is, the Rambo type character, but it seems like we're doing okay overall, so that's a good thing. Just a moment here, I'm going to get my better janitor to be upgrading this instead of this guy. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. He'll be able to upgrade it much faster, which will be a good thing. Go ahead and put a couple of plants out here. How is that room temperature wise? Uh, it's bearable for now. That's all we can really hope for. Alright, she's doing the research we need, so that's a good thing. Alright, this person needs to be trained now as well. Uh, you know what, let's do stamina training for them. And for... This guy, I think, was the other one that needed training. Let's just have one of the assistants do it. They can both be trained. Save us some money. Yes, she's doing our research. It's going to go slowly, but it'll be taken care of in the long run. Psychiatry required. Protagony. Sufferers have inflated, totally unreasonable perception of their own importance and ability. They must undergo a course of mild psychiatric psychiatric aberration to be reverted in from pathologically obnoxious to neurotically normal caused by two for one film tickets and learning relatively small com and letting relatively small compliments go to your head all right so let's pause we're gonna need psychiatry I have a psychiatry room template I believe it's gonna cost 14,000 and we don't have the money right now, so we're just going to have to wait on that. But we will get the money here shortly, I think. Not too concerned about that. Perfect, we got the money. Let's go ahead and change this so we can see where things are. Yeah, we'll sell that wilted plant as it is. And we'll put another log bench out here. We'll move this log bench to the center there. And we'll go ahead and put a couple plants out there. Alright. Then we're going to go ahead and put a bookcase along this wall. Oh, can't afford a bookcase right now. Would like a bookcase, definitely, so hopefully we can afford it here shortly. There we go. Has bookcase has been party? purchased. No, me neither. 
Alright, so we got that taken care of. Inspection report got us another five thousand dollars. That's a good thing. All right. With that money, we're gonna go ahead and start upgrading this room. I'll make the research go a little bit faster. We're sorry for the litter that you dropped on our floor. Would like to get a few more people in there doing research, as that would just help us financially. But that's going to be a little while still. She's going to have to do it for right now and get us to the 250 that we need. Which shouldn't be an issue. Yes, I'm spending money that I should be probably saving for uh, my debt and such, but you know what? I want this room up and running as functionally as possible. The faster she can do research, the better it's going to be. We're close to award season. That will also help us. We got three awards, that'll help us financially some. And that's the thing is, we don't have to worry about I patients use surviving, my per se. I want to spotlight a new local product. They're called Cheesy Gubbins. And they're made by a little company from right here in Two Point County. I just can't get enough of them. Mm -hmm. Tell your friends, everyone should know about them. Again, that's Cheesy Gubbins. Man, I might just go and have some now. Alright, so I'm pretty sure these guys are the ones that need psychiatry. Yep, psychiatry it is. Alright, so we'll go ahead and send those for psychiatry. You know where you need to go. How about you? Yeah, we know where you need to go as well. We'll send as many of the people as we can for treatments already, so that way we're not backing up our area when we don't need to be. Alright, that took care of several of our people. Nurse. I did want to hire one more nurse, I think. We'll go ahead and hire this person. Put them over here in the fracture ward. There we go. Alright, research wise, the research room is going well. Pharmacy. We will hopefully yes. yes. Another research monitor right there. Uh, 
love to get another one in here. Depends on if we treat enough patients. There we go. Let's see if I can move them slightly. So I can put another one. Right there. Alright. That will definitely get us through the research we needed. Now let's go ahead and, while we're at it, hire another doctor. We're gonna hire a bare basic one. We're gonna train that person in research. We're gonna have our other research person train them. So that way we're not having to pay for it. We'll have the two of them working in there. So, only these two will be capable of working in research. Doctor to research, please. That'll work out fine. Then we'll be able to make some more money that way. But now it's just a matter of getting through the rest of the patients that we have. Hawthorne. I hope you're enjoying some vintage wolf here on Two Point Radio. Unfortunately, we've lost a segment from the show, so instead, you've got me buying time until the next segment. Yep, that should do it. Let's go ahead and get in there, nurse, so we can get that person treated so they don't die. Yes, it's more money for us if they're treated. All right, so we'll get that nurse in there, work in the injection room. That'll work out perfectly. Looks like pretty much everyone's getting treated where they need to be. We still have about half the people to be taken care of, but that'll help us as far as our money situation, so that'll be a good thing. Really, I wanna pay off the first of the loans as soon as I can. And it looks like I should be able to do that fairly quickly here. Well, it looked like I was looked like I was going to be able to do that fairly quickly. Now yeah, it's taking a little bit longer. But if we get these people through, that'll be good. We'll be able to get that money in. Alright, perfect. Let's repay that loan. So that one's taken care of. Financially then, our our business overall is doing fairly well. We're going to need to finish upgrading this room, of course, and upgrade these two devices. But I'm not really wanting to do that yet because I might need that for Wave 6. I don't know. So we will have to see. And I do have staff in need of training. But that'll have to wait till this training is over. Yeah, as soon as this other loan's paid off, I think I'm gonna go ahead and use some money then to upgrade those last two machines, most likely. really love to be able to repay it this particular month here, but I don't know if that's going to happen or not. Maintenance required in 
Pharmacy. I still just find this whole place very weird overall. It's like it's a park and we're just building random rooms in it. But I guess that is what it is. Alright. All our money went away there, sadly. So, we probably will not be able to repay this loan. Huh. We'll let it go as it is. Alright. Start a training course. Let's go for Mechanics 2. There's the trainee is ready, and he's the one we needed to train. So let's get him trained in that. That'll take care of one of the two people we needed to train, and it'll be done for free. So that's perfect. Alright, I had originally put three people into this room to work here. I think two is going to be sufficient, though. Seems like the third person's almost just a waste there, so I'll just go with two. Alright, we'll get 11,000 from that, which will be a good thing. And if we get a few more people over here taken care of and processed, then we'll be able to hopefully have enough money to pay off that loan. Getting close. I only need about two grand more. We're so close. Just have one or two more patients cured and we'll be good to go. And we missed it. Unfortunate. Well, I guess we're just gonna have to wait for the next time on that. And we're doing fine money-wise. Uh, we're not losing money now. But I just would like to get rid of these loans because I don't know what I'll need for the Wave 6. So, it is a bit unfortunate that way. Alright, this person needs to go to the Fracture Ward. That is uh, an interesting thing there with that flower. I didn't notice that before. Attention, please urinate accurately. All right, so it's just a matter of treating the few people we have left, basically. That's all we have, so. I'm gonna go ahead and, yeah, that person's taking their break. Let's go ahead and have them go on break. Them go on break. Them go on break as well. So that way, everybody will be pretty much ready whenever we get to... Training Alright, probably just gonna fall short on money again. But it is the way it is. Hey, we didn't fall short on money. Let's repay that loan. Perfect. Alright, so we got that taken care of. We got two people to train here. One's a doctor, one's a nurse. Uh, let's train the doctor now in psychiatry. Let's have the other doctor train him. So that way they're both being taken care of at the same time. We don't have to deal with it. And it saves us some money. Last two people will get taken care of here. That'll be good. We will go into debt because, yeah, 
the end of each time we just don't have enough money coming in from the few patients we have left. It's just the way it is. We'll promote that staff, that's fine. We just got this last guy to hopefully cure here. Get him out of the way. Janitor, please. Repair research port. And these two are doing the research over here, which is a good thing. It'll make us some extra money, which that'll just work out nicely for us. Uh, I don't care about a level 5 staff room. Alright. This person's taken care of here. He's about to be either cured or killed one way or the other. And that will take care of wave 5. All 50 patients have been processed. Very nice. And he died. Ah oh, well. Next wave will begin in 7 days. So for now, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. If you enjoyed the video, please go ahead and click that like button. If you've not already, please subscribe to the channel, click the bell icon, so that you're aware when I produce new videos in the future. Thank you, and I hope to see you all again for the next episode of Two Point Hospital.